Hello everyone. So let's begin with the second tutorial that is installing Nmap on different OS. So let's begin the installation part of Nmap on Windows. So for that just type simply Nmap download on your browser. So over here you can see you can have the very first link about downloading the Nmap. Just click on it and you will see the download portal of Nmap and over here just click on downloads and you will see that you have different OS for downloading Nmap. So just click on Windows and you will go to this particular uh, post where it said that Microsoft Windows binaries. For that, you can see that you have a latest stable release of Nmap that is 7.94 setup.exe. So just click on it and you can see over here we have started downloading Nmap on our Windows. Okay. So after this, uh, you will get certain kind of setup where you can just go and you can uh, click everything, yes, and allow for uh, instructions to install Nmap. After it is done, we can go to our terminal and we can check whether which version uh, is running our, our uh, uh, Nmap and how we can use it. Okay. So... I'm skipping uh, this part because I have already downloaded the Nmap. Okay, so let's go there. Okay, so let's uh, check whether our Nmap has been successfully downloaded or not. So just simply type Nmap hyphen version and press enter. So you can see that we have Nmap version latest version that is 7.93 and on which platform we have uh, that is uh, i686 pc windows and what is compiled with that is nmap lib LUA. so uh, uh, library lua is nothing but nmap scripting language which uh, in which the nmap has been written okay and also we can have nmap libraries ssh uh, nmap library pcre uh, npcap uh, nmap dnet ipv6 okay now let's see whether we can uh, scan uh, using this nmap or not okay so let's check for the flags what we are having in nmap so just simply type nmap hyphen h and enter. So you can see as soon as you type for the help, you can have a list of flags or switches we can say in the nmap. So for host discovery or for check list scan, that is simple list target to scan, we can have SL. Okay, for scan techniques, we can have different for port specifications, services and all that. So let's just simply try a very uh, basic scan. That is nmap uh, with the domain name that is canme.nmap.org which is given by nmap itself. So it will take a few minutes to scan because it's trying to scan our network. Okay. So let's see whether uh, the nmap which we have installed in our network or in our system, it's whether it's working or not. Okay, here we have an output for the particular scan we have done that is for scanme.nmap.org in which we can have discovered that we have port 22, 25, 80, uh, 9929313337 and this all are TCP ports which are open and in which port 25 is filtered that is SMTP port. Okay, so now just uh, you can have your windows and try for more discoveries and, and scanning the and by using the nmap tool. So that's all for the nmap installation on windows.